So an SAE is a supervised agricultural experience, and this is a work-based learning project that the student really gets to individualize and explore different avenues and different facets of the agricultural industry on their own. And so these students can do anything from making their own lawn care uh, service to running their family's farm to even animals that they're showing at the fair. And so it really prepares these students to be able to go into any field regardless of the, if that's agriculture or not. So the SAE portion that really sets us apart from other programs, an SAE, the thing I love about it is it's for everybody. Those skills that are transferable to whatever career they choose out there, that they know how to hope if they're working for somebody else, show up on time, shake hands, look somebody in the eye. I think that's where SAE gives us an amazing leg up. From going to get a loan to all those things. If you're gonna do this, you gotta learn how to be a business person. I kind of dabbled in a little of everything. I started off with a vegetable garden production. At Lyman, we have a aquaculture and aquaponics thing where we partnered with the Parks and Wildlife Systems and raised tiger muskies and bluegill. I worked at McDonald's, I've worked there for seven years, and so I managed their books for food safety, um, taking temperatures, cross-contamination, and just uh, food management. Me and my brother started, I think, six or seven years ago, and we started out just mowing a couple houses around town. Two or three years into that, we decided to start an actual business now. I think we're up to 30 some yards. I worked for JBS, which is an international beef company, and I was in their corporate office and I worked in their international logistics department. I'm a freshman at Platte Valley High School. My FFA SAE project is goat production. I have goats that have been bred and then they will kid out. My hopes is to sell to other 4-H and FFA members to be able to show and as well as they can start their own herd. I'm a ninth grader, so a freshman at Platte Valley and I am part of the Platte Valley FFA chapter. My grandpa has been raising chickens his whole life. I've kind of wanted to carry on the tradition of raising chickens and selling the eggs, so I'm kind of proud of that. And I am currently getting 12 dozen of eggs a day, and I sell around 80, 90 dozen a week. I'm very biased, but no, I don't think there's anything else that really compares to the whole picture and the way it all fits together and the way we've been able to uh, figure that out over the years. I appreciate work-based learning because it has that element of, um, you know, you, it's not a how-to book. You learn by that experience, and that's basically practicing life. <laughs>